Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm just gonna jump right into it because I'm really tired and everybody's sleeping and I have school tomorrow after a four day weekend. So my sleep schedule is messed up. The other day I was in the store with my brothers and my sister. We were just walking around and my eyes happen upon the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Or should I say the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Get it? This is like the crayon freaking set that we all wanted as children. 64 colored crayons, a huge box, and the best part, you're not ready for this, a freaking sharpener in the back. My man's blue got us covered, or a woman's. I saved up $3 all month and I splurged on 64 crayons with a sharpener included. To do what? The most iconic thing you can do on YouTube. It's never been done before. I'm gonna follow a Bob Ross painting tutorial with crayons. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention, this pink long friggin' thing on the side is so I can do this. I have lights, a tripod, a second camera. I'm a YouTuber, the Grey Mountain. So let's start Bob Ross. I think it's actually gonna be kinda hard to follow with crayons from the beginning. So I'm gonna have open up in one tab the actual video, and then I'm gonna have another tab that final drawing. Cause if there's like whites and stuff with crayons, you can't add whites afterwards. So if there's whites that he adds in the end, I have to add them at the beginning. So it's a bit tricky to use this. I have to actually draw everything. Yeah, it's not like paint. I just wanted to use my sharpener crayons. All right, I'm gonna start off. Let's see what my man's Bob does in the beginning. Look at this cute little intro. Oh, you can't start this. King of YouTube. This is a pre-stretched double prime canvas. Then after I have a paper. Run all the colors or titanium white, bright red, cadmium yellow, yellow ochre. I'm just gonna use red, yellow, and yellow. So Bob Ross starts off by just with yellow. There's a bunch of red. Okay, these are all our reds. I'll use these for the sunsets. I'm just gonna have these right here. I'm just gonna pick them out when I need them. There's brown. Okay, I think I need all of these except the browns. There's no brown really. So starting off with the sky, Bob Ross, he does starts off with yellow. So here I have not cadmium yellow or ochre yellow. I have just plain yellow, so sue me. So I see there's a lot of yellow here. Okay, I'm gonna use this orangey red to blend the yellow with the red. I'm gonna use this called wild strawberry for like the pinkish part, because it looks like a wild strawberry. Okay, now I remember why I don't use crayons. Oh yeah, actually now I remember why I just don't color at all. I just hate coloring, it takes so freaking long. Like, I prefer drawing the picture and then just not coloring it, but. I barely did anything so far and I wanna quit. All right, I did like a lot of yellow like he did in the beginning and I'm gonna add some of this like orangey shade. I'm gonna go with even like a lighter orange. Cause the thing about paint is like, if you brush it on really lightly with like a base, it's gonna blend really nicely. Crayons don't do that. It's gonna be like a really hideous transition. I have to use transition colors instead of just like blending the colors together. Love that. This looks hideous. All right, I'm gonna go in with the wild strawberry, AKA pinky red. I hate coloring. All right, let's compare this to Bob Ross. Let's see what he's up to. Just sort of warms up your whole day. Warms up my day. will set your world on fire, so... That was a metaphor. He said red, a little bit of it will warm up your day. Too much of it will set you on fire. Wow, this man just like spits out poems. Ew! This is so freaking hard to do. Maybe I'm just bad at coloring with crayons. Maybe. I'm gonna send Cher Lloyd by Cher Lloyd and don't forget all the trouble we got into. Why does somebody not know how to flush a toilet after they've had a shit? What do you mean? Well, I was fucking one of yes. Disgusting! Disgusting. That's how I feel about this. Disgusting! Alright, now I'm gonna go in with some blue violet to do these dark, cloudy things on top. I don't know why. Did Bob Ross do it yet? No. Do I have any patience? No. Do I want to go to sleep? Yes. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I'm regretting this. I wish I had like the small and normal pack, but I don't have so much options. I hate choosing things. All right, so I'm going to just try to finish the sky in time-lapse because this is 
killing me. I have so much stuff to do. Alright, that took way too long and it still looks absolutely disgusting. Okay, maybe it doesn't look... Okay, no, it's disgusting. So you can see here, I'll put Bob Ross's right here. This guy is like very faded, nice. This looks like a murder scene, atrocious. Like I said, disgusting. I feel embarrassed with this. His mountain looks super duper dark now, and then the final thing, it's like really light, because he goes over it with light paint. I can't do that with crayon, so I have to start making my mountain as light as it looks like. This whole box thing comes with a new color called Blutiful. Did we need another blue? Did anybody ask for another blue? Crayola made another blue. Okay, so this is the normal blue we're all used to. And this little thing right here is Blutiful. What's the difference? So this is blue and that's Blutiful. Did we ask for it? No. So now I'm gonna do the mountains based on their color in the final photo. So I finished most of the mountains and I realized the freaking paper is too small. So Bob Ross's canvas is like wide. Well, obviously I should have freaking looked at that from the beginning, but I didn't. It's not this long. So I don't have enough room at the bottom to finish everything unless I cut it short. So the mountains, I'm gonna cut them short right here. And then I'm just gonna start like the water right here and put like the trees right here. So it's gonna be a little cut short and I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of freaking relieved. Cause I've been doing the mountains for way too long and they look DISGUSTING! I just realized I never used the sharpener. I could sharpen the black. So this black is looking a little blunt, as you can see. So I'm gonna use my beautiful sharpener, ready? That tickles. Um, that did nothing. It's very simple. Can I do that with crayons? No. Okay, so I'm using my sister's phone to record like upwards, but it just died and it was almost out of storage anyway. And this is what I have so far. Definitely not good at all. Doesn't look like a Bob Ross painting. Not blended. What the freak is that? Disgusting. So, um, I don't know if I even want to finish it. I kind of just want to melt it now and see if the colors blend. All right, I think I'm just going to try to finish it up super duper fast and this won't be time lapse because the thing is out of charge. So I'm just gonna try to finish it up. Here's what I have so far though. Beautiful. And also the freaking black broke. So this is the best I could do. The sharpener actually does suck. My childhood dreams are crushed. Okay, I'm completely done and that didn't take that long. You know why? Because I just did it really fast because I gave up. Ew, I literally just put red down there. Or it kind of looks super bad because I gave up. Like I said, I just did it really quickly. Wait, I thought it even looked good before. Why did I do this? All right, so here it is, guys. Yeah. Here was the original Bob Ross beautiful. Or should I say, beautiful? <laughs> Gray Mountain. And here's mine. I'm gonna take a lighter, put it over my drawing, and see if it turns into like a melty, cool, blended, beautiful, abstract image. Or the paper will burn, and I'll burn the house, and I'll die. Let's go. All right, so I have my little ugly thing here, and I have a lighter. All right, so I'm in my kitchen. It's really dark in here. Are you ready? Is the wax melting? Wait, it actually is kind of melting. The wax is like kind of wet now. All right, in my head, it just all like melted together and turned into this beautiful thing. But it got like uglier, it just burned. But I'm gonna keep trying this for a little bit more than I'm gonna give up because I might burn down my house. Wow. It's beautiful. The colors are blending together. This is what I wanted. Oh, disgusting, I made my stove.
something to burn. Keep going. Keep, keep going.